In this video, I'm going to show you how to calibrate your e-steps on an Ender 3 Pro without using a computer. And for this, we'll need a pair of calipers. So the first thing we need to do is heat up our nozzle. The reason for this is because we'll be going to move axis extruder and it's going to say hot end too cold. So we'll just go into temperature and put the nozzle at, we'll just go 215, should be good. All right, our nozzle is heated up, and what we're going to do now is remove this fitting. I already have some filament loaded up, so I need to remove that first. All right, I have the fitting removed, and I loaded a little filament through just because I'm going to cut this perfectly flush like that. So now we have the fitting removed, our filament is cut flush with the extruder. We're going to go to our printer, prepare, move axis, and extruder. Now we're going to go to move 10 millimeters, and we will move this by 100 millimeters. And now the filament should extrude 100 millimeters. The 100 millimeter extrusion has finished, and now we're going to cut this flush again. We'll take our PLA cutters and make this flush. So the 100 millimeter extrusion just finished and now we need to make this as straight as possible. So we're just going to bend it. I did my best to straighten this piece of filament out and now we're going to measure it with our calipers. So I got my measurement and it is 98.98 millimeters. This should be 100 so we're a little bit off. Now we're going to do a little calculation with this number. The formula is old value times 100 divided by our new measurement. So by default, your E-steps should be at 93, but just to be sure, we're going to check. We're going to go to Control, Motion, Steps, Millimeters, and E-steps, 93. So this is our old value. So now we can plug all of these values into our formula. It's going to be 93 times 100 equals 9300, divided by our measurement of 98.98, which will leave us with a total of 93.96. So now we need to go into our control, motion, steps, and we will adjust this to our new value of 93.96. And in my case, I'll be rounding up. And now we are finished. I'm gonna make sure we save these settings, store settings. Hear that beep and you are finished.